Hi, this is Kathy Shantler, online instructor with Bryan College School of Court Reporting. I am going to take you through today how to access the drop boxes on the Bryan College Real-Time Coach website. Remember to access the Real-Time Coach site, you will point your browser to http colon backslash backslash com. After you enter your username and password that were supplied to you from the school, you will be greeted with a welcome screen, such as what you see in front of you right now. To find the Dropbox for your class, click on the Classes tab. For those of you who are in Theory, Theories 1 through 4, you will click on the Theory Class Sessions. You will then see that for those of you who are in Theory 1 or Theory 2, you have a dedicated Dropbox, Theory 1 Dropbox, Theory 2 Dropbox. If we click on the Theory 1 Dropbox, you will see Theory 1 Dropbox for all Theory 1 students. And then you'll see a blue link saying Theory 1 Dropbox. Click on this Dropbox. You now have your upload screen. This is for all Theory 1 instructors, regardless of who you, is your instructor. To get your Steno Notes file for your homework into the homework drop box, you click on Browse. And make sure that you are in your Case Cat folder. For most of you, that will mean go through your hard drive. It may be a letter C colon backslash for your hard drive. You'll choose Cat 4. CAT4, the USR folder, then double click on your name and that will open up all of your files. The correct file to upload for your homework is the notes file. You will see that I have many files here that all have exactly the same name. We'll take, for example, Lesson 15 Readback that I hear, have here, L15 Readback. You'll see there's three L15 Readbacks. The way to know which one is the correct file is the one that has what looks like a pad of steno paper to the left of it. The first one has what looks like a gold symbol over the top. The next one is a piece of paper with the left top corner folded down. The third one is a pad of steno paper. That is your notes file. Click on the one that you want to submit for your homework. Click Open. And that puts your SGSTN, or Notes file, into the box. You will then click Upload this file, and that will upload your homework. For those of you who are in Theories 3 or 4, right now this month, we have the February and March 2011 classes going, you will click on whichever one is the one you go into for your virtual classes. I will click on the Theory 4 February, since that's the one I'm currently teaching. For Theories 3 and 4, after you click on the link to go into your virtual classes, at the very top, you will see a Dropbox for that class, Dropbox Theory 4. Again, click on that, and that will bring up the same screen that we just saw before, but now it is the Dropbox for Theory 4. Same process, click on Browse. Choose the Steno Notes file that you want to submit for your homework. Click Open, and then upload this file. Now for those of you who are in a speed class from 60 words per minute up, the general Dropbox is right down here at the bottom. When you click on the Classes tab, it says Dropbox. Click on Dropbox. You're then greeted with one choice, General Dropbox. Click on the General Dropbox, and again, you have exactly the same screen as before. This is where you upload your weekly assignments as well as your must. Same process. Click Browse. Be sure that you get to your Case Cat folder. Choose either the Steno Notes. For those of you that have a transcription such as a must, you will want to look in your My Documents area where you keep your document transcriptions in MS Word or OpenOffice. Choose it, select Open, and again, upload this file. 
Again, if you have any questions on how to use RTC and any of its functions, please be sure to check with either your instructor first. Help Desk also has a website, www.briancollegehelpdesk.com. Select the Court Reporting tab, and there are many instructional videos as well as help files there. I hope that this has helped. Have a great day, and keep on writing.